So guys, for the first method, you wanna head over to search and type in settings, click on it. And then once you're on this, we're gonna click on update and security. And now we're gonna click on activation. And now we're gonna click on troubleshoot. And now this will come up. You wanna run the Windows troubleshooter. If it detects anything, it will try fix it for you. If that's still not working for the second method, you wanna click on change product key. Just retype in your product key again. Make sure that you type it incorrectly and then click on next. You could also go to the Microsoft store and then purchase a genuine one from there. And now for the next method, you wanna head over to search and type in check for updates. Click on it. You wanna click on check for updates. Make sure your computer is fully up to date. And now for the next method, you wanna head over to search and type in view network connections. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you wanna find your network adapter, double click on it and then click on properties and then click on internet protocol version four. Make sure that you have obtained the IP address automatically and obtained the DNS server just automatically, both selected. And then click on OK. Now for the last method, you just want to simply restart your computer. And then come back into Windows and then try to activate it again. Hopefully this will not fix your problem.